this week on the Hoover Boys. Keep coming, keep coming. There you go. In that hole. In that Holy hole. Holy cow. Yeah. <laughs> 35, 36. <laughs> Got it? One shot? One shot. Brad never does that. Ouch. <laughs> Is that it? That's it. Yep. That's it. it. It's a dollar. Silver dollar. It's a dollar. Real, real, dude. Dollar. real dude, No, no. I, go, I, go ahead. Go ahead. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm tearing. You do it. No, dude. just go like it's this. It's a silver dollar. I know. I know. Just turn it over slowly. Please. Oh! Welcome to this week's episode of the Hoover Boys. Um, this is one of those days where we have no idea what's going to happen because we're out on the river searching for a new site. Unlike the last few episodes where we kind of knew we were going to find some stuff, today is kind of a make it up as you go type of day. Uh, it's Mark, Brad, myself. We're out here on the river, a new river, and uh, hopefully we find an old landing or a crossing or something along those lines. Either way, we're going to have some fun and try to save some history. Let's go. 17. Fishing sinker. Fishing sinker. First one of the day. They well, got there, huh? It's a newer one. Obviously. You gonna let me repurpose that one? Yeah. I'll, I'll put it in my sack then. Have Thanks, it. buddy. Have it. My first signal, 1718. Brad's got a fishing sinker too, so I'm gonna assume that's what this is. Got her. Nice steady bottom here. Oh yeah. No, that's a musket ball. Yeah. Something old. No doubt, that's a musket ball. It is not a fishing sinker. Woohoo! New spot. Going in. 15. Got a lot of wear, or is it nice? It's got detail. I didn't really look at it too good. Oh, you you found it, Muck, or I thought you said Brad found it. No, I got it. I'll take a look at that. Yeah. Gotta show something fun on this video, right? Fishing You got a fishing sinker? Right, I got a fishing sinker. Yeah. But Muck has something desirable, apparently. So let's look at that. What you got going on here? You got silver. You got a Ring wing, a winged Liberty dime. Winged. Four. Have you seen dated yet? Nope. I guess we'll look at that on a close up. Congratulations. Oh, thanks. Something fun today. Yeah. Been working out here hard. It's probably a 44. I hope so. <laughs> Yay! Something kind of old. 1942 winged Liberty Mercury dime. Do not believe there is a mint mark. But it is a nice silver coin. I would like to find something old today. Deep 11. Definitely sounds deep or small. Huh. Got it. I think. I think. There it is. Oh, it's trying to fall through my hole. It will fall through the hole, but it was on the, the edge. The bucky ball, something old. I now have two balls. Oh, mucks on the board with, with two balls as well. Very nice. I can't believe you put them in the same thing as your dime and you scratch them all up. They always belong together. Good looking balls. Yeah. You're gonna go sailing. New spot. More shallow there than I was thinking. It's not that deep. It's not that deep. 25, 24, 26, probably the best signal I've heard today. It's definitely tight enough to be a coin. Love to see something old. Besides my musket ball I got on my first signal today. Oh, we got it. Memorial, here we come. Maybe a clad dime? I don't know. I don't know. A copper. I see nothing. Oh, it is a copper. What? It is a copper. Yeah. yeah. 
spot. <laughs> yeah. Brad, I got a copper. What do we have here? I think it's a KG2. Oh, back to the KG2s? Yep, back to the KG2s from last episode. I can see the top of his bus. It's the early head. Yes! <laughs> Going for the day complete. I just wanted to find it something old. And that, my friends, is something old. Finally, something old. That is King George II, early head. You can see the top part of his bust. Definitely been worn down. And the reverse, eh, I'm gonna see a date. That wind is just too brutal today. But that's what we've been looking for. Old stuff. Now I got a 13, 14 here. How about a time back? Something as old as the coin. It's kind of deep. This could be a little Spanish gold coin muck. Right next to that KG2. I gotta walk back there to my truck. That's not very nice. Well, I'm about to find out. Gold coin, gold coin, gold coin, gold coin, gold coin, gold coin. Oh, that's a gold ring. Yes! Dude, I haven't found gold in forever. How about that? That's a gold ring, bro. Oh my gosh. That's a big gold ring. That's a big honking dude's ring, man. It fits my finger, yes, gold sir, ring. You finally got yourself one. <laughs> <laughs> Let me get a pound, dude. Yeah, buddy. You the man. Yeah, I see if it's marked at all. You the freaking man. Oh, that's a nice one. There it is. It's 14. Can you read it? Oh, yeah, sure. Can you see it in the band there? Yeah, oh, yeah, it's star 14K. That's, that's total, like, mid-century yes. stuff. Yeah. Nice. Yep, yeah, that's uh, Oh, cool. it's been so long since I got a gold ring. Oh, man. Should I wear it? Absolutely, put it on. I'm going to put it on, on the other side of my rubber one. It fits. <laughs> it's so dinky, though. <laughs> I like it. That ends a very long streak of no gold rings for me. Marked star 14K in a band. It's thin, but it, it's wide. If it fits my finger. I'm probably about a 12, 12 and a half, I think. Beautiful. Beautiful piece of gold. Hopefully there's more. 16. That was deep. Gonna be another gold? More gold? Oh no. It's a ring. A redneck wedding band. 13. You got some old? Old handle. How about a button? Where are the buttons at? You can't find a KG2 without a button. This is a this could be a combat button. It's an 11. You say a trigger guard? That's better than a handle. Oh, modern pull tab. Can I come check it out? No. No. Don't muck with me. I think it's a handle. It certainly looks like a small trigger guard except for the kick out. Shape of it looks like a trigger guard. I'm picking up what you're putting down, but that's a small trigger yeah, guard. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? Guess it could be a little boot pistol. Yeah, something small. I hope it's it is. It's definitely cool. Cabinet hinge or handle, but yeah, definitely yeah. different. Yep. Yeah. All right. Well, you got that now. Okay. Sixteen. I'd rather not dig another shotgun shell. All right. No more shotgun shells. Oh, is it another gold ring? It might be another gold ring. It's another freaking gold ring, I think. Okay. Two in one day. Dude, it is. It's <laughs> heavy. It's a chunky one. Holy cow, dude. Let me smack you and make sure you know you're awake. Look at that. Oh, look at that. <laughs> it's heavy. Thanks. <laughs> you mucking with me again? Nice. That's got some stuff in there that we'll yeah. have to get Brad eyeballs to see. Yeah. Oh, that's a date. I see a date on that side. 
Oh, it's all marked up. Nice. Yeah. I, th I think it says six seven sixteen. So nineteen sixteen. Nice. Two thousand sixteen, probably. Two thousand sixteen. Yeah. Eh, could be. I always cool. think on the older side. You always want to go to one of them swimming holes and find a bunch of gold stuff. Huh? Yeah, I do. <laughs> PNS 14K. I got double 14K. This one's not going to fit on there. I'm going to have to put that in my sack. Yes! Yes! Screamer. How are you doing, Brad? Wow, it's chunky. It's, it's a fat one. This is a 16. That was a 13. Unbelievable. Look how chunky that thing is. Is it S and P? No, no, there's nothing K? new about this right here. Yeah. I it? didn't think it's new. Muck thinks it's new. It is 2016. He's saying 2016. Do you know that Hallmark or that? It's it's six seven sixteen. It's 1916. Yeah. That's what I said. I'm, that's what I'm calling it. I, I'm pretty darn sure the Hallmark looks old. It's got an old maker's mark. It says P and S 14K. Then it has the initials. W somebody something. That's one brownie. W. Right. Somebody yeah, love that ring. This is sick, Ma. This you know, is put sick. it in there in my copper. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna leave that one on my finger. You're a spoiled little brat. You know that? You're a spoiled <laughs> I'll take big it. Brat. Big red brat. <laughs> big red brat. Oh, you're an animal. I could go for a big brat. If, if you uh, worst. <laughs> if you dig another one, I'll give you a bill. Yeah, give me a hundred dollar bills. Any go... variety. Don't get greedy. <laughs> I'd say it's safe to say we're on some sort of swimming hole here. Second gold ring in the same line. That was a shocker. Uh, the, the maker says S&P and then 14K. And then it's a WCW, I think. And then another set of initials. Had to be a wedding band. I'm sorry. The wind and the waves and the boat are rocking. And uh, the date is 6 7 16. Hopefully 1916. That's a fat little gold ring. It's got some girth. 14 sounds really deep. Gold depth, Brad. It's gold depth. Uh, buddy? Huh? <laughs> what? I told you I'd get one. You got a gold ring? I told you, I'd get one. you got a gold ring? I told you. Oh, you summon a guy. Is it a big one? Uh, it's, it's nice. It's not, it's, it's not the size of the last one. Oh, dude. Unbelievable. Three in one site. Oh, dude. So I had to show you that there's gold here and he stopped digging just the high tones. Is that how it works? <laughs> oh, that's a bunch of gold. <laughs> oh, man. Muck Did it is, fall out of there? Muck is I don't see it. Oh, there it is. Oh, it's beautiful, Isn't dude. Cool? It looks, you got designs on yours. It looks like my wedding band a little bit, in a way. Now it's That's got the break in the band, like yeah. the older ones. Those resize 14K. <laughs> Boom! That one doesn't fit. You can have it. Does it fit your yeah, little pinky? It'll, it'll fit my pinky just fine. Oh, no. Nope. <laughs> yeah. I know where it could fit. Well, if you're thinking about your wife's my finger, nose. <laughs> your belly button. Oh, boy. man, you got fancy on yours. Of course, you had to outdo me. Yeah, it's, it's split, though. That's interesting. Uh, it's cool, dude. I guess I hit it. That's got some heft. You have to let me know how much that one weighs. I might just do that. We, we could put it on YouTube. <laughs> put it on YouTube. <laughs> wow. Yeah. I'll, I'll stay here and dig low tones all day. Your gold ring has a coin edge. It's really pretty. Marked 14K down there in the band. It's upside down, but you can figure it out. I'll flip it over real quick. All right, now I'll put it back. I know that made Brad's day. I'm gonna put it in here and take a piece of his cheese. <laughs> Ain't it great? Yeah, I'll keep it. Yeah, what's going on here? Let's do it. It's exciting. Yeah, keep, keep coming, keep coming, keep coming. There you go. In that hole. In that Holy hole. cow! Yeah. <laughs> 35, 36. <laughs> 37. That is all the way clean. Yeah. Think it's gonna be like a half or something? That's scary. Maybe it's gonna be your first seated half dollar. Ooh, could be. I think it's a. I think it's a walker. Eight reals. The first full eight reals. I think it's a, a 1945 walker. A whole piece of eight. Let me go this way so the. the hopefully the wind isn't as bad. Mock up your tube top. 
This is exciting. Got it, one shot. One shot. Brad never does that. Ouch. <laughs> is that it? That's it. Yeah. That's it, it. It's a dollar. Silver dollar. It's a dollar. Real, real, dude. Snow dude. Dollar. real. Snow no, no. I, go, I, go ahead. Go ahead. Uh, rich or I'm, I'm tearing. You do it. No, dude. just go like it's this. It's a slowly. silver dollar. I know. I know. Just turn it over slowly. Please. Oh, it's an eight. Ooh. Got an eight, Rio? Oh, 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 dude. Oh my gosh. It's a freaking eight. Oh crap. I told you it was gonna be. Oh my. <laughs> it's a piece of eight. We haven't found it, anything old today. It, it, what is happening it's here? It's a whole eight. It ain't a piece, dude. Yeah, a piece of eight. Yeah, that's a piece oh, of eight. It's a piece it's of a, eight. It's a, it's a, that's what they call it, eight reals. It's a piece of eight. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Holy cow, dude. Oh, man, there it is. Yeah, get it in the sun. There it is. Oh, my. On, God. Believe it. Oh, it's unbelievable, dude. Oh, oh, my God. Unbelievable, dude. Up here in the freaking knee deep stuff. Oh, mucky. Man. All right, so what do we got? Bust or globes? 1807. 1807. Yeah. Holy cow! <laughs> you are the luckiest SMB oh, in the world. Yeah, pretty close, man. You got a whole eight. Got you got a piece of eight. <laughs> Pirate treasure and gold. Oh, man. Unbelievable. Is it all sauced up there? A little bit, yeah. It's tough to come off. You think it's a counter? No, no, it can't no, be a counterfeit. It's, it's real soon. Oh, 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 it's, oh, it's so big. It's an look at the look at the edge. I love the edge that they did on that coin. Oh, my oh gosh, it's dude. insane. I'm so glad I came over and lap dug that. Is this like concrete? Is it just muck? It's just muck. That'll come off It'll there. Come off. Work yeah. that off, and we'll do a close up, dude. Oh, well, there she is. A piece of eight, eight reals. <laughs> we don't know what's going on in the obverse. It's not a counterfeit. It is definitely silver. 1807. He's gonna have to work some some schmuck and schmooze off of it. But check out that rim. Holy cow! I cannot be I cannot believe that. We haven't even found a button at this site. <laughs> like what? Where did this come from? Left field. Yeah. Huge congrats, brother. Thank you. Oh, and he said he's got something in this little spot right here. Uh, top left? This one? Let's stop right here. This one. Hey! You got a silver? A nugget. You got a Merc? Unbelievable. You guys are insane. He says it's in the 1930-something. Sure, it ain't Mux Merc? <laughs> Say that ten times fast. Well, I was just taking a couple casts because it's getting about that time and Muck just found silver. He gave me this sign. It's been the weirdest day. <laughs> so you got shiny, huh? Yeah. I think so. I ain't picked it up. It's big! I ain't picked it up. It's a <laughs> big one! Come on, Muck! Here, do you want to do it then? Yeah, you go ahead. It's not far from the eight. Yeah. I bet it was a spill with it if it's Spanish, which it is. Oh my goodness. This is the weirdest sight ever. Uh huh. I guess it's a two, right? It looks like it. Spanish swimming pool. Two reals. Unfreaking, unspanking believable. <laughs> it's an older one. 1780. Nice. King Charles the third. Yeah. What the heck? <laughs> I was like, oh, I'll take a couple casts. The sun's going down. Unbelievable. Uh, congratulations, yeah. dude. I'll write it down. Thank you were you. you were due. I mean all you had was a Merc in your pocket, so oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right on. Wow. This is definitely one of the strangest sites I think we've ever been on. Not much old stuff, and then pal, really old coins, no buttons, and gold rings. And a whole bunch of shotgun shells and pull tabs. 1782 reals, King Charles the third, and that's only the second two reals Muck has ever dug. He's dug a four, a whole bunch of ones and halves, cut eights, all that stuff. But this is the second complete two reals. Beautiful coin, one for the Muck. The Herbie. 
<laughs> What's going on over here? I just beat the 12 behind Mutt's deucer, and I was like, here comes the gold coin. Oh, that's beautiful. But, yeah, that's a little I shivery, like it a lot. Uh, yeah. All right, there's a little Spanish gold coin in here I gotta find. Yeah, right. Oh, the sun did that thing again. So, I didn't find much in the last couple hours, but these guys did, and that was awesome. So, we're gonna go do a little wrap up. See you back at the truck. While I got a tiny bit of light left, we're in the truck. Brad dug an Indian head scent right there at the end. It's crusty, but we haven't filmed an, ep an episode, well, an Indian in an episode in probably three months. So there you go. Got an Indian, made it an episode. Well, if you saw last week's episode, you saw all the trash we went through today to find what we did. We landed, I don't know how many times we moved the boat probably close to 10 different times, 10 different places before we found this site and we didn't know it was going to be as good as it turned into. It was weird. It was good, weird. Good, weird. <laughs> it was very good and weird. Odd. Obviously all the hard work that went into it, a bottle. Here's the board. Even like, you know, like there's such random drops at this place. I mean, it's not even a full board, but what we found were choice nuggets. Get over my stuff first. Got old clock gear of some sort. Got a bag of barrel swivels. Pretty happy about that. Two pieces of clad. A musket ball. A bucky shot. Some lead. Modern key. The only possible navy button. That's a stretch. It's a, it's it's it could have been a button. The only thing that may have been. I got two gold rings today. Both 14 karat gold. This one's much smaller than this one, but this one's heavier than that one. At least in the hand. Let's see what the scale says. They get a KG2. Uh, the muck. It's got a bunch of clock internals. You know, a little. Is that a truck or a Jeep? It's a Jeep truck. What are you just calling a trigger guard? Maybe a drawer pull. Maybe a trigger guard. I don't know. He got a key. Didn't know he got a key. Maybe a pocket knife. He got two nice balls. He got on a spill of clad. Um, didn't get this on film. That's a half of a shoe buckle frame. And he got a mercury dime. And a two reals, 1780, King Charles III, two reals, really nice coin. Brad got on some talking money, a little car. What was this thing? That's a, a fossilized coral. Fossilized coral. I'm pretty sure, yeah. He got a clock gear thing. <laughs> the Indian, he didn't know it was an Indian until we were riding back. He got a Merc. He got on a gold ring with fancy. Nice coin edge on that. A Mike and Ike that's mm -hmm. going to go in my mouth. And an eight reals. I am so glad we live dug that. It's large. We're like, it's gonna be a peace dollar because you know we find some rings from maybe the twenties. I feel so big in my hand. It's chunky. Don't show the other side. No. And until next week, help clean up the ground, dig it all, and take your trash with you. Why, Brad? Um, because eight reals at the end. <laughs> because eight reals at the end, and all holes matter. See ya. Thirteen. Gold numbers again. Maybe. Just maybe. Come here. I can hear your machine. You stalking me? Yeah, you're so hot right now. I'm hot? Thanks, buddy. Hey, there's a shotgun shell. Get away from me. You brought your bad juju over here. I kind of saw 26, 27, 28. Did they leave me a Spanish coin? Got it. Come on. I want to do my turn. I want to do my turn. Let's just listen to it one more time. 28. Dead to nuts. Uh, should I sift it or should I pinpoint it? Let's sift it. Where's a massive coin? Oh no. What is this thing? They're digging out eight reals and I get this thing? <laughs> Is it a counterfeit eight reals? It's hold a bunch of times? No.